What's up guys? It's your girl Joycelyn. You can call me Joy. I'm back with another video. If you are new to my channel and have not yet subscribed, please make sure to hit that red button and subscribe. And if you are not new to my channel, I feel like I have some explaining to do. I keep taking these long pauses in between uploading videos. And you know, if you've been watching, then you kind of understand why, but I'm going to talk about it anyways. Make sure, regardless whether you're new or you're not new, to hit that thumbs up button and comment something lovely, something kind, something beautiful, and share this video. So, I was out and about. I'm sure you can tell. I'm hot. I'm sorry. I can't wait to hop in the shower. And, ugh. anyways, so yeah, my hair. I cut my hair. It's been about a month, though, a month and a half that I've cut my hair. I cut my hair, but. I'm pretty sure you noticed that was the first thing you noticed because my hair was long and it's been a month and a half so I feel like it already grew so I really like it I'm, I'm very happy it was an abrupt decision I actually went to take my niece for her hair and I just planned on cutting my ends and then I felt like a few hours before that I was like I want to cut my hair like I want to go for it like go go for it the last time I cut my hair so short was about three to four years ago four years ago you're probably wondering like what's up where have you been like what's going on all right guys the truth is that when I thought my change was done and over with it caught me off guard to realize that I had more changing to do. And if you've been watching my videos, then you fully understand what I'm talking about. It's a scary and lonely journey. And, and when I say lonely, I'm surrounded by people. I'm surrounded by positive, supportive people. But the mental and emotional journey, it's very lonely because nobody will understand. No one only God and it's a lot of things that I've been realizing and understanding from growing and strengthening my self-esteem my self-worth my self that then it turned into really right because it, in search of that it turned into addressing the trauma addressing my childhood trauma addressing things from my childhood that came out that I wasn't even aware of, let's put it that way, and then addressing my adult trauma. It was like, all right, you wanna, you wanna do this? Well, you need to get, get here first, and you need to heal this, and then you need to get back to this. Oh, but while you're here, oops, sorry, you need to right go back. Right now, I am far from the same person that I was last year. We are not the same. And so imagine three, four months ago where I thought like, wow, I woke up and I'm, I'm just not the same. A lot of things that I was asking for and like kind of begging God for, for months or for years to happen just happened overnight. And it was a lot for me to handle. It was overwhelming. I, I didn't really understand the new me. I was intimidated by the new me. Let's put it that way. Um, and that brought some emotions to me right now sometimes talking about about it out loud it's just it's different it's different it hits you different but anyways i was intimidated by the new me because it was just the strength that was kind of like injected you know um overnight and while i was so grateful it was very scary because i'm like okay you know as days and situations would go on and I would face different situations and stuff, I started to understand that I really wasn't the same. I didn't know how to handle it because I was just so used to handle a lot of things with allowing my heart to lead. And that wasn't it. So, <laughs> um, I thought that was that. I thought, okay, wow, I, I finally got to a point. My hair is hella puffy guys like my hair is right when i was like okay like wow this is a lot to deal with this is overwhelming i'm very grateful god thank you god for opening my eyes for enlightening me you know for helping me get to the next chapter thank you right when i thought like oh, i did it it was like no it's really hard i'm really good at multitasking okay i'm really great at multitasking when it comes to cleaning when it comes to cooking taking care of kids going here 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 you know work i'm 
I gotta give that to myself. But when it comes to multitasking of, <laughs> for whatever reason, growing, I just can't. And I and I kind of talked about that in a video where it was like, I feel like a cocoon. <laughs> there was that whole thing where I can't say cocoon or cocoon. I'm saying it wrong. But anyways, it's literally like that when I'm going through these little phases of growth, I just can't communicate. I just can't do it, you know? But I definitely wanted to hop on here and just let you guys kind of know because I can't be the only one that had been trying to better themselves internally for a long time. So I can't possibly be the only one that has faced these, you know, emotions and feelings or is facing these emotions or feelings. And it's not easy. And for whoever else doing that, I salute you. I salute you because it never ends. You're never going to get to a a point where you're all done you're you you're changed you're fixed you're healed never 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 there's always room for growth it's difficult it's really hard you really really need to want it really really need to ask for guidance it involves a lot of stress because you're like what is going on it involves a lot of tears and a lot of mixed emotions and laughter, you know, because sometimes I just burst out laughing, but it's like really like tears, but it's just coming out as laughter because I'm just so joyful of the change, but but it's an emotional joyful. Anyways, I don't know. I don't know what I just said there, but I'm saying the truth because yeah, I'm just talking. So it's just blur, it's coming out, but I'm not really registering what I'm saying sometimes. <laughs> But just believe that's how I feel because I'm talking about it right now, right? Remember this channel is super raw when I started this channel um, Over a year ago now That's what I would say all the time. This channel is raw. It's real and I'm gonna talk about things that a lot of people don't like to talk Talk about a lot of people are embarrassed to mention and I was one of those people that was embarrassed I used to sugarcoat. I used to put my happiness to the side to sugarcoat what was really going on inside of me What to sugarcoat what was really happening in my life in my family in my household Just por el que I was concerned about what people would say about me, but you know now clearly I, I don't give a damn anyways growth is no joke and when I really wanted to take this journey, I had no idea what I was asking for, but I'm grateful. I'm grateful. It's, um, wow. So many people that I thought was in my corner, so many people that I, you know, looked at as little sheep. You know, no, they wouldn't hurt a fly. Wow, like I'm telling you, it's it's not only been internal growth that just continues and continues, and and you know, um, it's been enlightenment, just me opening my eyes to just things that. Wow, <laughs> I am blown away, and so. I really need to go hop in the shower because this ain't it. Like, look at it. It's, it's not, I love it. I do, I do love it. But this right away goes poof. <laughs> it just goes up. But I really like it. I actually like it when it's like puffy better than when it's just like. Um. But to top it off, guys, on top of all the growth and, and all this extra, you know, change that has been taking place in my life, um, it was my middle child's birthday that turned um, seven. And it was my youngest child's birthday who turned three. But he also had surgery. He actually had surgery before his birthday. So it was literally middle child's birthday, then surgery, literally than his birthday while he was still recovering so um yeah it was insane and not to mention baseball season has been crazy it has been so insane but they are running around with the two different teams while i'm with the baby and yeah it's a lot and and the hot weather it's crazy and i really hope to continue to 
talk to y'all and update y'all and do cool videos for you guys you know where it's not just these talking but you know this is how i started my channel i started my channel sitting down and talking to you guys and being raw and being open and so i always have to incorporate these videos because without these videos my channel would not be what it what it is so yeah um i'm gonna go because i'm hot your girl's hot look at this um but appreciate you guys tuning in do not leave this video without giving it a thumbs up i really appreciate it as always if you didn't subscribe yet please go ahead and hit that red button and subscribe make sure to leave something pretty something kind a beautiful little comment there i appreciate it and i will see you on the next video i don't know when but we'll see right we'll see